sound. What is that? It's an, uh, a war whistle. Hello guys, welcome to your favorite movie channel. And as you already know, we have brought to you another mind-blowing episode that I know you cannot resist. Guys, do you remember the movie Breaking Bad? I'm sure you do. And you keep tabs on the prequel TV series to Vince Gilligan's Breaking Bad, Better Call Saul. I'm sure you have an idea of what we've brought to you already, right? Yes, you got that right. What we know about Better Call Saul Season 6. In today's video, we will be discussing all we know and what you should expect in Season 6 of Better Call Saul. But before we dive into the business for today, make sure you click the like button. Yes, the one with the thumbs up icon, and then click on the subscribe button to join the amazing family. How do you feel about being the first to receive notifications? of our new videos? Amazing, right? Then click on the bell button icon beside the subscribe button. So guys, welcome once again. Today's episode promises to be exciting as usual. But before we start the main deal for today, let's do a throwback to the movie for our new friends who are just joining us and those who want to refresh their memory. Better Call Saul is an American crime television series that Vince Gilligan and Peter Gould created. The series is more or less from Gilligan's previous series, Breaking Bad, released in the mid-2000s in Mexico. The series is centered around a man, Jimmy McGill, Bob Odenkirk, an earnest lawyer and former con man who later was changed to a greedy criminal defense attorney known as Saul Goodman. The series also features the moral decline of a retired police officer, Mike Ermintrout, Jonathan Banks, who becomes closely affiliated with the Juarez drug cartels to support his family. Jimmy and Mike's interactions remain sporadic until their respective storylines fully converge. When the Breaking Bad spinoff Better Call Saul was first aired on AMC in 2015, it it was unclear what type of show we would be watching. Saul Goodman, the scheming lawyer character, had his serious moments on Breaking Bad. Still, he was a comic relief source in a series trafficked in white-knuckled suspense, particularly in its final seasons. So guys, I'm sure you have a glimpse of what the series Better Call Saul is all about now. Then let's move on into what we know about the series. Will there be a Better Call Saul season 6? Obviously, yes. That is what I am here to tell you. According to the showrunner Peter Gould, Better Call Saul was renewed for a sixth and final season in January 2020, right before the fifth season premiered on AMC. From the inception, I have not had the doubts that Better Call Saul would have a sixth because the creator has to tell the complete story of our complicated and compromised hero, Jimmy McGill. And now AMC and Sony are making that dream come true. When will Better Call Saul season six premiere? Except you are yet to see the series and you do not follow up on the series release dates. We, the fans of Better Call Saul, are used to waiting. The series was first aired in 2015 and after the fourth season was aired in 2018, 2019 passed without a new season, and the wait for the next season could be even longer. It was later revealed that the global health situation disrupted the plans to shoot the final season last year, 2020. But guys, this year, Bob Odenkirk delivered some excellent news. The show will resume shooting in March. I can't wait for the fireworks, really, Odenkirk told Deadline. Our show is a bit of a slow burn over the past few years, and Gilligan and Gould build up. There are certainly exciting moments throughout, but but towards the end, it gets super, supremely intense. So, when do we expect to see the fireworks? That is still uncertain at this point in time, but we are sure to see our favorite series back on television by the end of 2021 or 2022. You all have to sweat it out waiting for AMC to announce the premiere date. Are all the cast members returning? This is worth discussing, as we all have seen several series where new faces take up the role of a cast, and it kind of changes the chemistry between the viewer and the movie. But in the case of Better Call Saul, Bob Odenkirk will be returning for the last season to play Jimmy McGill, aka Saul Goodman. Breaking Bad fan favorite Mike Ermintrout, Jonathan Banks, will also be back, along with Ray Seahorn's increasingly compromised attorney, Kim Wexler. Also, we should expect the faces of Howard Hamlin, Patrick Fabian, Nacho Varga, Michael Mando, Gus Fring, Giancarlo Esposito, and Lalo Salamanca, Tony Dalton, too. If you've been following the series from its very first season and you have seen other series by Gilligan, Breaking Bad, you would see that most faces in Breaking Bad were featured in Better Call Saul. Here's another question for you guys. How many more Breaking Bad cast members will feature in the sixth and final season of Better Call Saul? You can drop your answers in the comment section below. In season five of Better Call Saul, Dean Morris's DEA agent Hank Schrader and his partner Steve Gomez, Stephen Michael Quazetta, were among the cast members. The series also featured other casts from Breaking Bad like Tuco, Huel, Gale, and Crazy Eight. So we are definitely going to see more faces from Breaking Bad in the season finale. Todd Alquist, Jesse Plemons, Jane Margolis, Kristen Ritter, Skinny Pete, 
Charles Baker, and Badger, Matt Jones, all featured in El Camino. Skylar White, Anna Gunn, Walter White Jr., RJ Mitty, and Marie Schrader, Betsy Brandt, and Tortuga, Danny Trejo, are the rest of the Breaking Bad cast that are unlikely to feature in this season finale of Better Call Saul. Still, we would be glad to see them on the television, right guys? Let's take a short break to share a fun fact. Who are the only two characters to appear in Better Call Saul, Breaking Bad, and El Camino? You have just five seconds to answer that. All right, your time is up, guys. The correct answer is Mike Ehrmantraut and late actor Robert Forster's disappearer, Ed Jalbraith. Welcome back from the short break. I'm sure you all got the answer, right? Still on the cast that will likely return for Better Call Saul season finale, will Brian Cranston's Walter White or Aaron Paul's Jesse Pinkman return for the grand finale? In a recent interview, Paul revealed that he would be down, and so has Cranston. I would be in it if Vince Gilligan and Peter Gould, who are executive producers on it, wanted me to be in it, said Cranston, when asked about it during an interview in August 2020. I would do it in a second, but it has not happened yet, I can tell you, and we will see. I don't know. Gilligan is actually known for surprising his fans, so do not expect too many leaks. We all are waiting eagerly for the grand finale. How many episodes will there be in Better Call Saul Season 6? I have a quick question for you guys, and the winner might end up winning something big. How many episodes were in the previous seasons of Better Call Saul? You all have forgotten? Oh, never mind. I will just keep my gift. But you can still drop answers in the comment section below. The previous seasons of the series Better Call Saul consist of 10 episodes. Did you get that right? The sixth and final season will have 13 episodes to give the story a wrap up. That will bring the total of the episodes on Better Call Saul to 63 episodes. If you've watched Gilligan's previous series, Breaking Bad, you would know it had 62 episodes, including the other one titled El Camino. However, the final season of Breaking Bad, which had 16 episodes, was divided into and was aired in two different years. Still, the sixth and final season of Better Call Saul will not be divided into halves like Breaking Bad. According to Gould in August 2020, during an interview, he said, AMC is our lodestone here. When asked about the possibility of splitting the season, he disclosed, I mean, my preference is to have the episodes run one right after the other, but AMC knows what is right for them too. And if they feel that they want to break it up in a different way, that is something that is worth discussing. But I think there is a power to just having one episode after another. What will the season finale, Better Call Saul Season 6, be about? Better Call Saul has a fixed destination, and you will agree with me if you have already watched Gilligan's Breaking Bad. The series will always focus on Jimmy McGill's gradual transformation into Saul Goodman, with all the moral slippage it conveys. When Gould was asked in an interview about what the sixth and final season of Better Call Saul will be about, he said, I think by the time you finish watching Better Call Saul, you're going to see Breaking Bad in a very different light. He includes that, I think we're going to learn things about the characters in Breaking Bad that we didn't know about initially. We're going to learn things about the events of Breaking Bad that we didn't know. And we're going to learn things about the fates of a lot of these characters that may surprise people or certainly throw them into a different light. I think we started this 2000 seven. So that's 13 years of work that's distilled, that all has to fit together, hopefully like a perfect jigsaw puzzle. The most important thing that the final season will have to resolve is the cliffhanger involving vicious Lalo Salamanca, who will now be looking to exact vengeance on Nacho after surviving the assassination attempt. Also the storyline with Howard and the Sandpiper case should come to a conclusion. So guys, that will be all on today's episode on your favorite movie channel. Thank you for staying till the very end of the video. I'm sure you enjoyed the video just like the previous ones. Kindly like and subscribe to our YouTube channel to watch more exciting episodes on your favorite movies. Don't just subscribe. Also turn on our channel's notification by clicking on the bell icon near the subscribe button to get notified whenever we release a new episode.